this kick of unboxing videos uh, I'm sure that you can hear a, a audio quality difference in what's been going on uh, what, what I have right in front of me I'm using my webcam microphone because again today we're gonna be trying out some microphones so this time we've got the AllVoxCon A800 now there's a difference between the 800 and the 700 and the difference is the microphone head jack now this is marketed as a professional quality streaming microphone. They say that it's perfect for podcasters. Uh, if any of you guys know any podcasters, it, it says that it's perfect for streamers, for musicians, things like that. So we're going to get down the brass tacks and see just how good this microphone really is. Let's go ahead and hook it up. Before we do... Make sure you guys stop over at Zero for Hire on minds.com that's where I'm going to be hubbing all of the videos and the podcasts that we record here the weekly podcast comes out on Monday every Wednesday we'll be doing these videos and uh, yeah so let's get to the unboxing not doing fancy setups I'm not doing multiple cameras or anything so we're just opening up this box let's tilt the camera down a little bit while, while we do that maybe maybe that'll be better <laughs> All right, so first we've got some uh, some paperwork, and we've got okay, we got a microphone cover, so that's good. I I actually was hoping to get one of these soon. We've got uh, what is this? A cable of some sort? Oh, a holder. So we've got a mic stand for a holder for the mic, so that's good. And looks like what is this? The cable. So we've got the the USB cable and like a little mini stand. And then finally, we've got. Uh, if I can get it out, there we've got the, the microphone, microphone itself. That's a lot smaller than I was expecting it to be. I'm actually going to co uh, show you a comparison once I get this all hooked up. So I'm going to go ahead and hook this up. And we'll uh, check out the features. Like right, at, right, right away though. It's pretty. It's pretty heavy. You got. You want to feel how heavy it is? Not heavy to me. It's not heavy to you. It, well, for for how small it is, it's actually heavier than I was expecting. You got your volume knob right there. If if you can see that. So it says a eight hundred, and then this is very important. I want to make sure that I have a zero latency micro uh, headphone jack. So we'll find out. Whether or not this is zero latency or if, if we're dealing with something else. Yeah, let's go ahead and hook this up and see how this bad boy sounds. All right, so we're back. I've got this all set up. And the kids are wearing the headphones, so I really don't know how loud I am. Now, if I turn up the volume on there. Yeah, that's, sorry, that's just a monitor for them. I don't think it changes the, the how, how loud it is. In the, I, I have my screen monitor. So turning it sideways, like I said, this is very small. It It's a little bit weighty, but once you get it on the stand and you lean it back, it's really not that bad. Now, the problem that I had with my other microphone of this type was, see, this is, this is the M100 that I've been using. And normally, I would have it on a stand very similar to this. And that thing would just, like, fall apart. It, it, I mean, not fall apart, but it will like, fall over. It tipped over a bunch of times. It's, it's been dropped several times, so that is why I had to start shopping for a new one in the first place. Well, one of the reasons. Um, but as you can see, it balances really well with the microphone and stuff. You just tilt it back, 
it's it's angled well enough for your for your voice and then we're just going to go ahead and put this mic cover on here maybe ah! is that really loud in your guys's ears yes oh my goodness okay so now i've got my windscreen or filter or whatever i guess that could serve as a pop filter a, a, a little bit as a pop filter a pop filter yeah <laughs> A pop filter is so that you don't hear like so bad. Um, it doesn't always work, but it's good to have a, 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 a filter or a windscreen or whatever. Uh, I'll think of it as a germ screen. So when I'm interviewing people, uh, they're probably sick and I don't want to get sick. So put that on the microphone. I don't know. What do you guys think of the sound? Loud. It's Super pretty loud. loud. I mean, I could make it louder. No. No? Give me one of the headphones. I want to hear it. Okay. Careful. Because these, the, these are the good ones. Okay. Yeah. Wow. So the sound is zero latency. That is exactly what I'm looking for in a microphone. Zero latency. It's nice and small. It's, it's really compact. And with the A800... You want these headphones back really bad, don't you? With the A800, you've got a box that's smaller than like your typical phone book type size you know it's it's not very big at all like this and i can get everything in this box so this can double as a carrying case that's a nice feature um now the price point on this is really low i think you should be able to get one for around 30 dollars, maybe maybe cheaper if you know where to look it's probably not going to be something that you're doing professional music recordings with but, you know, it's it's really, it's more about the engineer and what you're able to do with it than it is uh, the equipment. So, this is a very clean, very clear sound, USB. I'm really impressed with it. There's not a lot of air buzz or whatever, but like I always say, what really matters is how it comes across in the recording. So, you should be able to hear the difference in the recording for this, and we will see you guys on the next video. What do you guys think of this microphone? Good. You like it?